Good day, everyone. You are welcome to this week's Business and Investment Tips program, a production of Christ Church Radio. My name is Ayodeji Ebo, an investment professional. This week, the focus is on understanding the Nigerian's VAT system and the third quarter 2020 VAT collection numbers. Value added tax, VAT, is a consumption tax or tax on spending. It is a tax on the sales of goods and services that the final consumer eventually bears, but collected at each stage of the production and distribution chain. VAT is not paid on all items, hence the list of exempted goods and services can be confirmed on the FIRS website. All exported goods are zero rated, that is, such goods are vatable but at 0%, so no VAT is collected from the foreign buyer. The current VAT is 7.5% of the value of the goods and services purchased or sold. This was increased from 5% in February this year to boost government revenue. Based on August actual 2020 budget performance, VAT revenue accounted for 14.1% of total non-oil revenue and 4.7% of total actual revenue. VAT is also projected as 16% of non-oil revenue in the 2020 proposed budget. It is good to note that the states and local government collect about 85% of VAT, leaving the federal government with 15%. The VAT is collected on behalf of the government by businesses and organizations registered with the Federal Inland Revenue Services FIRS for VAT purposes. Businesses are expected to register for VAT and a record of the goods and services purchased should be kept for proper remittances, that is input VAT. VAT claims can also be made when goods and services are sold, output VAT. The registered firm either pays to or receives from the FIRS the difference between the input tax and the output tax. Many SMEs do not consider the VAT when doing their cost analysis. As a result, they usually get shocked when accountants calculate how much they are meant to remit for VAT. It will help you if you decide how you want your pricing to work. Do you want it inclusive of your goods and services prices or exclusive? Meaning, if you are selling an item for 100 Naira, for exclusive means your net sales is 93 Naira to cover and VAT is 6 Naira 98 cover, which goes to FIRS. For inclusive, selling price is 107 Naira 50 cover, which includes VAT of 7 Naira 50 cover, which is remitted to FIRS. Registered firms are expected to remit monthly. VAT returns and payments are normally made monthly to the FIRS on or before the 21st of the month following that in which the supply was made. Last week, the National Bureau of Statistics published the numbers of VAT collection for the first nine months of 2020. Based on the data, VAT collection rose significantly by 22.9% year on year, the highest in 10 quarters, to 1.1 trillion from 876.1 billion naira in the first nine months in 2019. The increase recorded year-on-year can be attributed to the 50% hike in the VAT to 7.5% in 2020 from 5%. The quarterly analysis shows that VAT rose by 29.8% quarter on quarter from 372 billion naira in the second quarter of 2020 to 425 billion naira in the third quarter of 2020. When compared to the third quarter of 2019, VAT collection increased by 54.4% year on year from 275 billion naira, which obviously is also due to the hike in the VAT. On a sectoral analysis, the major growth driver of VAT collection in the nine months of 2020 was professional services, which rose. 39.5%. Other manufacturing increased 19.3% year on year. State ministries and parastatas improved by 44% year on year. And transport and haulage services rose by 82.3% year on year. The VAT collection mechanism remains weak as the majority of SMEs have not been captured. Efforts need to be intensified 
in using technology to drive the collections and remittances as well as creating more awareness to the SMEs. To incentivize SMEs, the new VAT regime stipulates a threshold of 25 million annual turnover for businesses to register. This means companies with a turnover below 25 million will not charge their customers VAT. However, VAT will be paid on their own purchases. Thank you for listening. Please join us same time next week for another exciting and insightful session. For comments and feedback, kindly forward to CC Radio at FCCGChristChurch.org or send SMS to 070-8246-3747. Stay blessed.